Hey, what's up, Scott Balkan here with Imagination Creation Films, and today, well, we've got another exclusive here on the channel, a first look at something really cool. It's uh, not the Kessler Kill Shock. It's a lot faster. This is the Kessler Kill Shock Recon. A low angle, high speed, vibration isolated camera platform to get shots like never before. Three full feet of damn. And this is it. And it's not really close to the camera. It's, it's actually this big. Yeah, this is the brand new Kessler Killshock Recon. And this thing is beast mode. Now you've seen some other uh, isolator systems out there on some cars that kind of putt-putt around. This can go 55 miles an hour. It's four wheel drive. It is a one fifth the size of a, a normal car. And uh, it's got quite a few upgrades on it that make it, uh, well, just a little extreme and something that you really would expect from a company like Kessler. Just a note on these vibration isolators here. There are four levels of isolators you can put on here. So there's uh, red, blue, black, and matte black. And they go from light to extreme. As well as you can put any combination of them on here, up to three. But you can go as low as one or you can have three of the matte black heavy duties or any combination thereof. It's, it's literally a ton of thousands of, of options that you can do to tune this perfectly. Up top, we've got a ton of 3 8 and quarter 20 pre-tapped holes in, up here, as well as it is pre-drilled and tapped for Free Flies Toad in the Hole system, Ronin's universal uh, uh, plate uh, that works with either the Ronin 2 or the Ronin S. Uh, it is literally very versatile up here. So let's talk about what makes this whole package extreme because it does start off as a stock Losi DBXLE 2.0 smart electric car, but that's not good enough. It needs to be able to handle a payload, a severe payload. Uh, so they had to make custom Fox shocks for this. These are not standard. These were actually custom made specifically for this and they're tuned and adjustable to help make this ride super smooth. So think about it. You've got a heck of a suspension here and you've got isolation and vibration dampening here. Uh, it weighs 32 pounds with, with everything as it's configured here with all the isolation mount and the custom shocks as well as this right here. Now what is this? Well, let's get that in one second. It can run on two standard 4S batteries if you want, but they teamed up with DigiIgnite, and DigiIgnite's been in the uh, battery accessory business for quite a while, and basically they convert DJI TB50 batteries to be used on Movies and, and other uh, items out there that 
could stand to use a better battery pack because the DJI TB50 is pretty fantastic. This allows you to plug in two batteries up here and you could then split and run your Movi off of it as well. Or you can also put TB50s on your Movi up here. So with two of these on board, you're running your car and your Movi and even your camera if you want with 195 watt hours of batteries. Now, it does go 55 miles an hour, but that does depend on payload. Uh, you put a heavy payload on here, it's gonna slow it down a little bit. Not a lot, you're not talking 10 miles an hour here, you're still talking fast. Also, your wind load. I mean, when you start stacking stuff on here, you start to create this giant sailboat and it will be like driving a giant brick down the road, but it has power to spare. So you're still going to be cruising at a fast clip and faster than any other that's out there. So let's talk about the price point because there's a lot that goes in this and prices can get carried away really fast out there in the industry. Kessler's done a lot of work to keep this cost down so that you can be running for very little money. This whole unit right here with the custom shocks, the isolator plate, uh, the, which is a kill shock, and the standard red springs on here. This will sell for $3,800 and that includes a remote control. Now this is the optional uh, TB50 battery system from DigiIgnite. It's called the DigiIgnite Recon. And it sells for $899 and it's available through Kessler. Bolts right onto the back and it's amazing. Then on top of that, you might want to add a Bluetooth module that will allow you to use uh, the um, Spectrum uh, dashboard phone app for full telemetry, uh, that type of information, speed, temperature, RPM, voltage, monitoring, as well as trim and other settings. They're all adjustable with that Bluetooth module. So that's something to keep in mind as well. But really, you're talking about, oh, and you're going to need some batteries. You're going to need the TB50 batteries if you decide to go this route. If you don't, you just need two 4S batteries. Um, but really, when it's all said and done, you can have a fully configured, ready-to-go Kessler Killshock Recon for less than $5,000. That's pretty affordable, and you're out the door. All you got to do is add your favorite Movi, your favorite Ronin 2, your favorite any kind of, of gimbal up here and have some fun at up to 55 miles an hour. Now, this thing is going to be available starting in early January, so not too far off. And there's going to be some really cool videos. Yeah, they're really cool. Those are going to be posted very, very soon. Um, I didn't get to uh, to do this one today. Um, I'm sure that was on purpose because they've seen the way I handled RC cars in the past, which is to say very well and professional because that's what I am. But this is right now the, the only one in existence and it, it, it I, I probably could have twisted their arm, but I don't wanna do that. This literally is the one and uh, it's right here, right now. But let's take this to the next level, and this is really cool. And our friends over here at Kessler have given the channel a, we've talked about this many, many times, the Kessler Quick Receiver. And this is an Arca Swiss receiver, brand spanking new. I, I mean, I just opened it right here. But they're giving this to us to give away to one of you out there. And let's, let's talk about how that's going to work. So you need to watch this video. Well, you already have because you're right here. You need to be a subscriber to this channel. You also need to go over to Kessler's Facebook page. Give them a follow. Also their Instagram page, go ahead and follow them there. And Twitter, go ahead and follow them there. Now this is the honor system. This channel is 100% about people being actually good and human 
just like we all are. So please just go do that. It's, it's worth it because you want the latest details about this as well as all the other great Kessler products out there. Uh, this is not sponsored by Kessler. They did give this to me to give away, um, but it's not sponsored. I can say whatever I want to about this thing. Um, well, minus the language. I mean, I, I had some really strong language positively to say about it, but I don't want to put this on the channel. But subscribe to this channel. Go follow Kessler on uh, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. And then, and then this is how we're going to do it. So make sure you do that. Go down to the comment section and uh, tell me what you want to shoot with the Kessler Killshock Recon. Tell me what you want to shoot. Some, some ideas because people are wondering, what would I use this for? Well, I'll give you some ideas and then let that get your juices flowing and, and get some ideas running in your head. Uh, let's say you've got a, uh, a jogger and you want to get some good footage of that jogger cruising down the road. How about a fast runner? How about a sprint? How about a race? How about a Lamborghini cruising down the wonderful uh, road and you don't want that shot right up on the hood. You want that shot way low at the ground level, but you don't want it to just be a GoPro mounted in front of it. You want this to be, well, you could put anything, an Alexa up there. You could put a, a uh, well, you could, yeah, you could mount an LF. You could mount a Red Monstro. You could mount anything up there. If you can fly it on a, uh, a gimbal, well, you can get it and get it nice and close. And with payload to spare, I mean, you could get a great lens on there. All of the, um, the follow focus and zoom controls, if you want to put a zoom on here. And uh, yeah, you could track that Lambo, I mean, up to about 55. We'll, we'll, probably, we'll call it 50 with uh, a, a payload. But that is a, that's a great use case for it. And I know you can come up with some ideas. So to win, well, to qualify to win, put a comment down below and tell me and Kessler what you want to shoot with this. And uh, I will pick within a week, I'll pick one of you to win this and I'll ship this out to you. And uh, yeah, that's, that's it. That's super easy. Um, I mean, this is awesome. I use the heck out of these things, and uh, yeah, yeah, I'm going to leave a comment on what I plan on doing with uh, with this when I buy one. So uh, yeah, as always, if you have any questions or comments, put them in the comments down below. I try to read and respond to each and every one, even if it's just to say thanks. Uh, I do have a Patreon or a PayPal if you wish to tip me or support me that way. I greatly appreciate all my supporters. Uh, use my uh, Amazon affiliate links down below. Um I mean, they, they help out a little bit. So, I mean, if you want to just help the channel, just click on one of those links and you don't have to add that to your cart. Just start shopping on Amazon. It's all great. Um, always remember to subscribe to this channel. Click the little alert bell and put on all notifications. That way you know when I'm live. Um, and then uh, give it a thumbs up if you like this video. If you don't like it, meh, it's okay. We can still be friends. Just give me a thumbs down. And uh, as always, as I like to leave it, don't let your passions center around your life. Let your life center around your passions.